daytime seems so nice to me. It's the start of a new day. And there's no place in this world that I'd rather be than right here. With daytime in you. Right on, baby. Right on. In the words of the great Barry White, I'd like to welcome you to my YouTube channel on YouTube. I'm your host, Polo Trap. In the other day, <laughs> well, as you see, it's today's Valentine's Day, and I'm rocking on my pole red. You know what I'm saying? I broke out the red on y'all. Okay. Um, wow. Today's topic. This is for those people that just hate Valentine's Day. That's right. I know it's some of y'all out there that just cannot wait until this day is over with so y'all can basically go back to normal, okay, so you can stop riding around and seeing people just doing ratchet things, okay. I keep doing that in videos, you know what I'm saying, just saying ratchet people, you know what I'm saying, because people be doing some ratchet stuff, like, you will never see the, the van with the teddy bears and all that stuff outside, you know, on the corner with the guy blowing the bubbles. Yeah, maybe it's just Philly, you know what I'm saying? And I don't know. Maybe wherever you're from, they probably do that too. But this video is for my peoples that cannot stand February the 14th. Cupid must have been a real straight shooter. He must have had. Because y'all, some of y'all are just, just bitter, scorned, and just hearts are just cold. What's going to happen when it's your time to shine? When someone does come in your life? When they first met you? Remember? You know what I'm saying? When they come into your life and they shine their life, are they going to be happy? With what they say, something to think about. Um, my people that hate Valentine's Day. What was it a bad experience? I raised my hands. I had a couple bad experiences on February 14th. Am I better towards it? No, I remember them, but you learn from history, you learn from your mistakes, you learn from the past. Maybe last year, you know, you was all lovey dovey, feeling. That's why I love you. You know what I'm saying? And then this year, you're like, man, F Valentine's Day. You know what I'm saying? So, I don't know. Listen here. I figured I just want to make a video. And I don't know. I mean, listen. Valentine's Day, to me, is like, it is what it is. You know what I'm saying? It's like, is you is or is you ain't. You know, there's no in between. Okay. This Valentine's Day, I don't have a Valentine. Okay. So what big deal? Maybe next year. Okay. So, just for my people that hate Valentine's Day, what is it about Valentine's Day? Here's my spin on it. What is it about Valentine's Day you just cannot stand? Is it because all these fake lovers all of a sudden. Oh, I love my dog. Oh, I love her. You know what I'm saying? All of a sudden. What about the other 364 days out of the year? Mm hmm And here's another thing that, that, you know, it may not strike you, but I, 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 I just, you know, realized it, right, over the years. Did you know, males, that females have more holidays than males? Oh, you ain't know that, did you? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Females have more holidays than males. Think about it. I'm going to start with Christmas. Matter of fact, Thanksgiving. Thanksgiving. They in the kitchen cooking. Some of them. Some of them heifers is in the kitchen cooking. I don't know why that one's doing around, uh, going from house to house, taking to go plates. Wrapping up in aluminum foil. Some of them you come with their own aluminum foil. That's Thanksgiving. Christmas. 
Now you're under pressure to buy her a gift. Christmas. Mm-hmm. That's true. All right. Now we got Valentine's Day. Now you're under pressure to buy her some teddy bears and candy and you may propose to her or whatever. It's all about the female, right? Valentine's Day. Easter Sunday. She wants you to get dressed up, go to church, so she can wear her big brown hat. Mm hmm. Easter. Mother's Day? Uh, <laughs> I ain't got to say too much about that one. But that's fine right there if you count Thanksgiving, Christmas, Valentine's Day, Easter, Mother's Day. That's fine. And if she got a birthday in between any of those holidays, bam, that's six. Okay? Mm-hmm. Yep. So basically, they got, I'm going to add another one. I'm going to add another one. The Memorial Day or, 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 4th of July. Right? And I'm going to throw this one in there. We was at six, right? So Memorial Day, 4th of July, 7. And then what if she's going out to an event? I'm not saying be cheap, brothers. I'm not at all. You know what I'm saying? But it just seems like they have more holidays than we do. What do we got? Birthday, Father's Day, Christmas, and maybe Valentine's Day. Okay? Easter Sunday, they don't favor us. No. Fourth of July, we on the grill cooking. Memorial Day, Labor Day, we on the grill cooking. Do that favor us? No. She may be in the kitchen making some sides. You know what I'm saying? But, you know, enough so no. I ain't throwing no bitter rant, you know what I'm saying, about being cheap on all. I'm not cheap. It's just, it is what it is. You know, I'm in school, and my focus is on that. I have tunnel vision. All I see is books and numbers and everything else all day. Okay, so if you hate Valentine's Day, leave a comment on this video, okay? Because I know there's a lot of cats out there right now that's schmucking, schmucking, okay? They out there schmucking, trying to make up, trying to get some yams, <laughs> yams, oh yes, yams. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? Try to get on her good side. Alright. Well, listen, y'all. I got to go. I got things I got to do. I got languages I need to learn. And campus is the only place on earth that you can just tune out the rest of the world to deal with whatever you got in front of you. And that's my, my take on campus life. Okay? So... Tune in tomorrow. Same time. Same place. Right? For another video in the adventures of Pole Train. Okay? Leave me comments, questions, and concerns, as usual, on my Facebook or on my YouTube channel. Subscribe, y'all. Please subscribe. How hard is that? You want somebody to make you laugh all the time? You know what I mean? Don't be rich, okay? All right, y'all. I think I said it now. Polo is cool as the other side of the pillow. So when you go to bed tonight and you feel all the cool little pillow areas, that's just me right there. Cool as the other side of the pillow. Cool as it is outside. Under 45. And there's no place in this world I'd rather be than right here on Facebook and YouTube with daytime and you right on, baby. Right on. Please believe it with no exaggeration. I'm out. Peace and blessings to you. And this has been a Trey Woodley production and distributed by. You too. Peace.
Happy Valentine's Day to you. Now, you heard a little voice. To the lovers, happy Valentine's Day from Polo Trade. Wink.